<laughs> like I said, what to do? Joe's ignoring me, and Mike said, don't text me anymore, and I won't use me. And I'm so tired, and my eyes are, like, falling out my face because I never sleep because it's so hard finding a boyfriend. No, I cannot have a baby with the guy who leaves me. I can't struggle. I love my life right now, and I do not want to struggle in life. I'm too pretty to struggle. I, I do not want to struggle. So I cannot be pregnant with either Joe or Mike because Joe doesn't even live in Maryland. He lives in fucking Pennsylvania. And Mike is a deadbeat. He has a nice pool and a nice house, but Mike is a piece of shit. He had the audacity to text me saying, don't text me anymore. And he's like, you're beautiful inside out. You don't need to be dealing with these fuck boys. Like, what are you doing right now? Shut the fuck up. He's weird. So I like country guys, rednecks. He doesn't even country. He doesn't stand Trump. I stand Trump. I like Trump, but I also like Obama. I like Obama better than Trump. But I like, if the guy doesn't like Trump, we're not gonna work out because Trump is a troll like me. You know, I like Trump because we're both the trolls. You know, we like, we love to mess with people's head. It's funny. That's why I like him. And I also like Obama, but Obama's better than Trump. I like both of them, but yeah. Um, we're trolls and it's funny. And he's like, get rid of the thugs. I love that. And then he's like, Chinese virus. I like that too. So he's funny, you know? I agree with some stuff he says. Not everything, but some stuff. I like that he's racist sometimes. I think it's hilarious. Like, remember Rick? I remember Rick. You remember Rick? I remember Rick. Rick was a huge Trump supporter. I mean, most of the guys I date, they're like huge Trump supporters. Most of the guys I date, like, I like country guys, rednecks, guns, big trucks, trailer, trailer guys, hillbillies. Like, I'd rather date the country guys and the prissy, prissy, decent white guys. I don't like decent guys. I like the bad guys, the trashy guys, you know, <laughs> big ass trucks, guns, you know, um, bad bitch guys. Then the prissy, prissy, decent white guys. I don't like the decent white guys. They're too boring for me and they're too decent. I like dirty guys, the dirty, rough guys. That's what I like. I'm small, medium, not big. That's nasty. I am married, but I'm getting divorced. Okay, I have a secret. Everyone knows this. Like, I literally got married to the wrong guy, but everyone knows that. The main reason why I got married was to get out the house. That was one of my main reasons, because I hated living at home with the stupid mom. But I always knew I'd be out the house before 30. I was like, oh, you're going to be 30 still living at home. You're going to be 30 still living at home, bitch. I moved out when I was 22. You know what I mean? Like, I fight for what I want. Just like right now, how I'm getting divorced. I'm not going to be living here forever. Once I find the right guy, I am moving out and moving in with him and getting pregnant. I like to leech on guys. I'm not independent, and I never will be. I like to leech on guys. I know exactly what I'm doing. When I get pregnant by him, he can never freaking leave me because now we're closer than ever. <laughs> You know, I'd be like, now we're closer than ever. I do it on purpose. I am married, bitch. I'm getting divorced. Shut your mouth. No, I am married. I'm getting divorced. I just married the wrong guy. He's not my type. I'm married for money, not love. So, I'm married for money, not love. And that's why you don't marry for money. You marry for love. I'm not taking a ring off till I find someone serious. So... That's why I'm living here. I wouldn't be living here if I wasn't married. This is not my kind of area. It's boring. It's dull. I'm too bored here. I need excitement. I need excitement. And it's so boring here. And that's why I like, I, like, I like going out in the country with the fields and the dirt bikes and the motorcycles away from everyone. I hate people. Like, I hate people. Like, literally, like, I fucking hate people. Like, I fucking hate people. I do not like people at all. Growing up, like, the schools, like, school and everything, like, I literally hate people. I fight with everyone. Like, I hate everyone. The only people I don't hate are hot, sexy white guys with big trucks. They're the only ones who don't piss me off because they're like me. We act alike. They're tough. Well, I'm not, like, tough. But I do have that side where I'm like, fuck you, bitch. Fuck you. Like, aggressive side where I'm like, fuck you. Fuck you. You know? Like, I stand up for myself. Like, the country guys, we stand up for ourselves. But I don't like tough you know what I mean I'm submissive I'm not like boom 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 I'm submissive you know um so like um yeah like right now I don't have a baby but I can't wait to have a baby 
Yeah, I'm pro-life. I am pro-life. If I I would never have a baby with the guy who leaves me because I don't sleep around. I go on dates. That's two different things. The difference between going on dates and sleeping around. I do not sleep around because I'm not like that. And also, you guys don't understand, actions speak louder than words. If I were to have sex with every single guy, I'd have so many kids by now. You guys are stupid. I don't do that. I go on dates trying to find the one. I do not have sex like that. I don't even have a boyfriend to do it like that. But every month, we hook up with at least one or two hot, sexy white guys every month. Every month, one or two hot, sexy white guys, that's who we hook up with every month. That's it. I don't have sex like that because I don't have a boyfriend. I don't sleep around. I'm not like that. So therefore, I would never be a single mom whore because I'm not like that. And I'm pro-life. But if that were ever to happen, of course, I'd take care of the baby. But um, it wouldn't be a happy life because the dad isn't there. The dad isn't there, so it won't be a happy life. A baby needs two parents. A baby is most likely to make it with two parents, not one parent, two. I'm not stupid. I'm smarter than you think, bitch. And I don't want to live in an apartment either when I have my baby. I want to live in a house. I am not stupid, bitch. I'm really starting to like, oh, living in a fairy tale. Bitch, what fairy tale? Because I know what I want. What fairy tale? Because I don't want maybe the guy who leaves me. Bitch, what fairy tale? Shut your mouth. There's no fairy tale. This is real life. And I know exactly what I want. And I'm not going to stop until I get it. My prize is having my baby and no one's going to stop me. My winning prize is having my daughter and no one's going to stop me. And I'm going to have a baby and no one's going to stop me.